a wonderful opportunity to have an insight on the Farm Qualifications Recognition Services done by NZQA. Um, and we got to see how the process was car um, broken down and really unpacked. And it was really insightful to see how they contacted overseas institutions, how their evaluations were done. And these are great insights as we prepare to review our guidelines for Farm Qualifications Recognition Services. Also, it was good to see um, the point of references and, and just the areas that New Zealand focuses on when they're evaluating for our qualifications. It's really important so that when we do the review of our guidelines, we're able to focus on those areas and try to bring it up to some sort of comparability um, to make uh, comparability easier. It will definitely be Dolly's presentation um, and her team. She went into great detail on the areas that you have to look at when you're evaluating, sort of unpacking um, verifications and evaluations. Also, I enjoyed uh, the session with the Workforce De Development Council. Um, that was really eye-opening because for Samoa, you know, our office, we do the development, we do the consultations with the stakeholders, but here in New Zealand, like it, it's specific to WDC and they have such a high engagement, high level engagement and coordination with the stakeholders, which is something that we're trying really hard to achieve in Samoa. So taking that and taking some of their methods and approaches will really help us to improve our service. The, the databases and the registers, um, there is just a, a wealth of um, a wealth of information that they have in their database because they're subscribed to international um, platforms, which is great for me because that's my area of specialty and sometimes it's quite um, difficult to have contact with uh, overseas institutions and accrediting institutions. So to be able to tap into that pool of resource would help me um, a lot. And also, um, Looking at the record of achievement, at the moment we're developing our database for record of achievement and just seeing the back end of the database, um, the application form, the provider portal, it, it was all great. I think it was a little bit of an information overload, but it's good having these um, resources and new approaches taken back home so that we can try and um, contextualize and see where it fits into our own processes.